five months. This has been five months, and you're telling me I'm not allowed to question it? Apparently, he was seen out shopping with his wife. There can't be much wrong with him. It's just depression. It's not cancer. I wish I could sign myself off for months at a time because I was feeling blue. You don't know how serious the symptoms are. He's a good guy. So, you're telling me I have to continue to pay his salary out of my budget until... when? Look, it can't be easy. All I know is that my workload has increased. But guess what? My pay hasn't. Cut the guy a break. It might not be as simple as depression. I'm all for looking after my staff if they need my help, but it has to go both ways. Do you know, I can't even get him on the telephone anymore. Every time I try, his wife answers. Bloody human resources. They are so scared of lawsuits, you can't say boo to a goose without them coming down on you like a ton of bricks. Nervous debility. What's that even mean? I'll be suffering from a nervous debility if this isn't resolved soon. I have the quarter reports coming up, three new contracts coming in, and I'm not allowed to recruit a new member of staff. Our suggestion would be to contact him again and arrange a meeting. Maybe we could sit down and discuss the situation. Find a resolution that would be suitable to all parties. He was shopping for ornamental garden furniture with his wife. It can't be that bad. His symptoms change from one day to the next. Hmm. Well, maybe he could work from one day to the next. day to day, darling. Maybe tomorrow will be better. Uh, Jeff, it might be for me. Sorry, he's not available at the moment. I understand that. Uh, didn't you get the doctor's note? I'm sorry, I'm not sure my husband's ready for this. Um, let me talk to him and see how he feels, okay? Goodbye. <laughs> Jeff, that was work. Oh, no, no, no. They no, want to make no, a visit. No, no. Just to see how you are. It'll be okay. I promise. Yeah. <laughs> 
It's ever gonna be 